Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to do a fall shop with me and then I will do a big haul at the end. The first place that we're going to go to is Target. So we're going to check out everything that they have at the Target dollar spot. Um, if you guys enjoy videos like this, please give it a thumbs up so I know to make more. But let's get shopping. So guys, this was the first time in probably three to four months that I went to Target and the dollar spot was actually stocked with items. Since April, it has been completely picked through every time that I go. And I'll go in the morning, I'll go later on in the day, and it's just never stopped. So I was shook to see that it was actually stocked this time and they did have some really cute fall items for, of course, affordable prices. And they had a whole Halloween section. So if you guys are in the market for some affordable fall um, decor or Halloween decor, head over to your Target dollar spot. Hopefully yours is as stocked as mine was. sort of empty shelves, but I promise you this is the most stuff that they have had in a really long time. I thought those little knit hats were so stinking cute for only $5. What a great price. Um, and then they had a ton of the tobacco baskets. I was really drawn to this one because of the darker tone, but those are really cute to put maybe some white pumpkins in or even to style them on a wall or to have them as a backdrop behind um, maybe some pumpkins. But I thought this was really cute. When you are decorating to ground your decorations, it is great to have something under them. And these little tobacco baskets for just $3 are perfect for that. And then OMG Halloween Explosion. They had so much Halloween stuff. For Brooklyn's little play area, I was gonna do fall, but I'm just gonna jump right to Halloween. Um, she wants it to be Halloween. It's more kid friendly, so we're just gonna do it. So that video will actually be coming up in the next few weeks. Um, I have some, a bunch of things from last year, and then a few new things that I actually picked up from the Target dollar spot. But yes, her little area is gonna be decorated for Halloween. And this little pillow was just $5 and with the burlap and black, I thought it was gorgeous. And look at these placemats. Um, I love them, the cute little sayings. They had about three or four different kinds and I just think they're really pretty and adorable. Um, let me know down in the comments below, are you guys decorating for fall or are you just rushing straight towards Halloween? This year has been crazy to say the least. So I am finding so much peace, so much solace in just decorating our home and making it as comfy and cozy and fun for me and my husband and our two children. And I was actually also a little surprised to learn that they actually had a little bit of fall items out and we will get to those just a little bit later. But look at all of this fun Halloween. Me and mother, mom were here and we were talking, I was telling her that this stuff is so fun to decorate a playroom, your children's area, anything like that, or just your home if you are crazy into Halloween. We usually only decorate the outside of ho the house for Halloween, and then I will do, like I said, Brooklyn's play area for Halloween. But the rest of the house stays pretty neutral and just with fall decor.
I loved all of the greenery that they had and the cute little signs. And then in a little bit, you're gonna see the picture frames. These were so cute and adorable. I just love the little ringlet on top and the black color and then that matted gold. So great in a living room or a family room to display your special pictures. And then they had a ton of signs and then these were actually runners. Um, they are great for just $5. I'm just really picky with my runners and I like them a little bit longer. So, but that would be good to layer over another runner. And then they had these little crates. They came in packs of twos. And then, oh my goodness, this, these um, little reefs were just adorable. And then the signs. I always love the Target dollar spot for their little signs. They're so cute. They're great for tier trays or just to hang up in any small space. And then they have the trucks. If you decorate with the little trucks, um, they have them in the green, the gray, and the blue. all the way to Michael's and they had such great pieces here. All of the Michael's decor was 40% off and uh, they just had some really special great pieces and their florals, there was a ton of floral. So you were, any type of floral that you are looking for, head over to Michael's, they have them and they were also 40% off. section had such cute items and I was really drawn to these little fabric pumpkins but as you guys know if you've seen my previous videos I put them in the cart and then I took them out because I do not need any more pumpkins I am pumpkin out and I can't believe I'm saying that because I love them so much but I wind up putting them back because I really don't need any more pumpkins but these pumpkins are just so cute just so darling and I love that muted pop of orange that they had. And then these candlestick holders I thought were really cute, but for $19.99, I would want a little bit better of a deal, but I did like their muted color. Michael's if usually has some of my favorite decor. Um, I like to go check out all of the stores, but Michael's had some of my favorite Signs, some of my favorite pumpkins. They are just priced a little bit higher than a lot of the other stores. Um, Walmart probably had my most affordable favorite decor this year. And then Hobby Lobby is always a staple, always a standard, and you can find decor, any type of fall decor. If you're doing traditional, if you're doing black and white, whatever you would want, you can find that at Hobby Lobby. I will link down below my Hobby Lobby shop with me. Um, I have gone to Hobby Lobby, Michaels now, Walmart, and um, I think and then Target. Those are the stores that I have been to to shop for fall decor. <laughs>
you're gonna see that Michaels has a pumpkin explosion. But I do have to say their prices are just a tad bit higher than the ones that you would find at Hobby Lobby. But I did like all of their traditional colored pumpkins. They were very pretty. The quality was great. Um, but like I said, they are priced a little bit higher than the items that you would find at Hobby Lobby. And look at these pine cones. I'm weird. I refuse to pay really for pine cones. Mom, where I work, there's tons of pine cone trees and I'll just go and pick them outside. Um, yeah, I'm not buying pine cones from a store. I will just pick those up. tobacco baskets were much better quality and these were gorgeous but of course they were $19.99 much more than $3 which you would find at the Target dollar spot but look at those little canisters too so cute and then I've seen a lot of people this pumpkin was so heavy the pumpkin pie recipe um, pumpkin but it was also like $30 but it was a pretty heavy pumpkin um, and then I love these measuring cups. They were so cute. And I loved all the beautiful pops of, of fall colors they had. And they were only $17.99. truck this was probably the cutest one that I have seen at any of the stores all season it was just really adorable and then I love their little boxes their autumn boxes their little crates those are great to do little vignettes in and they kind of ground all of your decoration and then they had tons and tons of monogram stuff so you can find things to go with your last name your first name whatever else you and then tons and tons of signs. They were much more than the ones that you will find at Hobby Lobby, but they came in different materials. So they had wood ones, and then they had the metal ones, and then I really was drawn to this um, doormat. It said Hello Pumpkin, and I love the orange color mixed with the natural tone. And then more red truck stuff. So if you are into red trucks, Michael has a ton of stuff. And then I just had to show you guys this glimpse. They had Christmas, a lot of Christmas stuff. So Christmas antlers, Christmas picks, Christmas, Christmas, Christmas. So the stores, Christmas is out already, but I'm not quite ready to shop for Christmas yet. If you are, go for it. But I, I'll just let you know, Hobby Lobby, Michaels, a lot of the stores are already putting out their Christmas items. So if you are in that spirit, go for it and go shopping. Start, start collecting your items.
my last stop was Big Lots. And um, I don't know if you guys have a Big Lots in your area, but it kind of has a little bit of everything. It's a more affordable store. And I was just in the area, so I decided to take a stop in here just to see what they had out for fall and Halloween decor. And they did not disappoint. They had some really cute pieces for both Halloween and fall. And then just different colors than I've seen at some of the other stores. So I wanted you guys to take a peek here. So if you have a Big Lots in your area, go there. They have some great fall and Halloween items that are out. And their prices are pretty affordable. I really love this pillow it kind of had like that burlap fabric around it and the material to me kind of felt like an outdoor pillow and for only $14 I thought that was such a great price but I was really shocked and surprised at all the different kinds of decor that they had at um, Big Lots I love this whole neutral section that um, if you are into the truck thing I've talked a lot about trucks if you were into trucks they had black trucks they had cream trucks they had blue trucks so they had a variety of trucks if you were into that and then the snuggle is real I thought that kind of looked like that um, little pumpkin that I saw at Michaels but for eight dollars you really cannot beat that price and then this hello pumpkin I signed I thought was really really cute for only eight dollars And then I really love this section. They had that seafoam spa green color that I really love. And they had a pumpkin in that color um, and a pillow as well. And I just thought um, that this pillow felt so nice and cozy. I thought that would be great for like a master bedroom. Um, the pumpkin, I love that pumpkin. I wind up grabbing one from Home Goods which I did get a quite a better deal on that pillow, on that um, pumpkin. Um, but yeah, they had some really great stuff. And hey there, pumpkin, that rug I thought was really cute as well. And their doormats are only $12. And they're a great size and they're great quality. I'm just scared to get a white doormat. I think it'll look dingy after like one day. Because we are rough on just everything at my house. So um, it would drive me crazy. But I thought that these white pumpkins, these metal pumpkins were really cute as well. And they were 20 bucks, which I thought was a little bit steep. But most of their items at Big Lots um, are really affordable. And then they also had some bigger pieces as well and some signs as well. Their larger pieces seem to range from 18 to 20 some dollars. Um, this sign, which was a really good size, was only $10. So really affordable prices and really cute fall pieces at Big Lot.
after this, I did run into Home Goods, but it was really crowded. And I will show you guys at the end what I got there, but it was really crowded and I was confused by all the arrows, so I did not film in there. But I'm gonna show you guys a haul right after this. So guys, um, I am back home and I'm gonna haul everything that I picked up. This is stuff that I've picked up over the last two weeks. My parents were in town and visiting us. Um, that's why I didn't have content up last week. But um, we did a little bit of shopping and I grabbed a few more items that I'm super excited for and I'm going to show you guys. So the first thing is this pillow from Home Goods, and it kind of incorporates all of the fall vibes, like all of the colors and everything that I'm going to be using in my home this fall. And it is this one. I'm actually not going to be using very many truck things, but the blue truck, you guys know that's my favorite color of blue the uh, pops of orange, just the greenery, the rope detail around here, the gray and white. All of these are the colors that I will be using throughout my home this fall and I just had to snag this pillow. It was only $16.99, but it just incorporates everything. So I love it, it's super duper cute. It's one of those lumber pillows. I'm not really sure where I'm gonna use it. I'm kind of leaning towards my front when you come in the basket there, but I'm not sure I'm gonna move some things around, but I love it, it's really, really cute. The next thing that kind of goes along with that, as you can see, complete same vibes. Um, I also picked this up from Home Goods. It was $6.99 for the two pack, and these are really good tea towels. I did not have any fall tea towels. I know I used fall tea towels last year, um, but I must have given them away or donated them or something of that sort. So I picked up these and I just love the color. It has that blue and some neutrals and just the black lettering. And I thought it was really cute and it completely goes along with the kind of fall vibe that I'm going to be going for this year. So love these. Can't wait to put them in my kitchen. And then also from Home Goods, I snagged this pumpkin. So, oops, complete same vibe. Um, this was $12.99, which I thought was a great deal, and it's such a good size. And I think in my kitchen, I'm going to put this on. I have um, a cake stand, and I always have like florals or something like that on it, but I think I am going to incorporate this pumpkin on it. So I'm so excited, and I can't wait to use it. Also from Home Goods, I picked up this candle. I don't do a ton of gold, but I'm not opposed to mixing stainless, gold, different metals, but it smelled so good, like I had to get it. It is, it was only $7.99 and it is the DW Home, that brand, and it is Vanilla Pumpkin Scent. And I wish I had like smell-o-vision. It smells so good, like sweet with a tinge of pumpkin. I don't know, I'm pretty sure I'm gonna burn this in my kitchen. I'll make it work somehow, somehow, even with the gold, we're gonna make it work. I think it'll look fine, but it just smells so good. I have to burn this in my house. So I was super excited. Home Goods has some of the best deals on candles. $7.99, you can't beat it for this size. Target had a few fall candles, but there are $10, which isn't a ton of money, but if I can go to Home Goods and snag a better deal, I'm gonna be I'm gonna do that. And this is like a little pumpkin, and I thought it was really cute, the packaging. And then I'll probably have it set like that while I burn it. I can't wait. Okay, so next is the tar Target dollar spot. And my Target dollar spot was like playing games, okay? So they did not have a lot of merch out. I had to go to several di different Targets in my area. There's only one in my town, but all of our towns are kind of small in Cali, um, where I live. So there's like small towns right next to each other. So each one has their own Target. So I had to hit those up because my target was playing games. They did not have a lot of stuff out, but I picked up a few items I wanna show you guys. So I picked up this banner. 
I keep telling you guys that I'm gonna make a banner and I got some stuff from the Dollar Tree to make a banner for Brooklyn's play area. Cause Brooklyn's play area, I was gonna do a whole fall thing when I decorate now, but um, I just was going back and forth and I asked her what she wanted and she gravitated towards this Halloween stuff. So it's her play area, not mine. So I'm just gonna, just gonna do it. So I'll have fall the rest of my house and her little play area will be kind of Halloween. <laughs> so this banner, it has the little, it was from the Target dollar spot, $3. It had the little cats and the little pumpkins and I thought it was really cute. So I can't wait to use it in her little area. And then also from the Target dollar spot, I told you guys that was $3. I picked up these little figurines and I think I'll sit these on her little table in there. And I just thought they were really cute and they were $3 a piece. And they go along with the vibe and the theme that her area is going to have. And then I also picked up these tea towels for her little play kitchen. And they were um, $5 and they are um, the little spider and you get a two pack. And I thought it would be really cute and it goes along with the vibe and the theme of her little play area. And then we, I picked up this little cauldron, I think you call it, and it was $3. And I picked up some pumpkins because I'm going to style like a little vignette on her table. And the pumpkins were a dollar from the Target dollar spot. So this one is orange inside and I thought I could like sit a pumpkin somehow inside like do a little vignette thing on her table. She's really good with the vignettes. She doesn't really mess with them. She will fix them. She'll take it off to like play and do whatever, but I try to not have them like impede her space so she can still like surf, do all of those things. But um, yeah, I thought it would be really cute. And these, these pumpkins were just a dollar. This one has a bat on it. This one has the spider webs. And then this one is just the velvet and um, black. So her area is going to be super duper cute and Halloween soon. <laughs> and then also from the, same, the Target dollar spot, I picked up this pillow. It's just the burlap on the front and the black on the back. So why I picked up the banner is because the little ornaments that I was going to use to make a banner that we picked up from, that I picked up from the dollar store, I'm actually going to use them on this little tree. It's glitter. It's perfect. It's wonderful for her little play area. It'll look cute with a little vignette I'm going to do, but I thought that we could do a craft and paint those and then she could just hang them. I'll use some twine or something off of the tree. So instead of making the banner, I'm gonna use those for something different, but they're still gonna be, oops, <laughs> they're still gonna be used. And typically this little tree does not do that, but when I was making my way out of Target, it dropped and I didn't wanna go back in to grab a new one because I dropped it. So I just have to glue it down, but it's just, it has a spider there and it's glittery and it's sparkly and it's a little girl's dream. And she's going to love decorating little ornaments and putting them on here. And like I said, that part doesn't normally come off. I just dropped it and I just need to glue it down. So five bucks for that tree. And then not the Target dollar spot. I did grab a few more things. I'll just show you guys. Um, from the Target dollar spot. Where is it? Some Halloween socks. Like at school, they usually do like a crazy sock day. So I grabbed these. These ones are glow in the dark and then these ones are not. And I grabbed those. They had a bunch of these little things and I thought it would be fun for her to dress up in her little area. So I grabbed the bats. All of these were a dollar. The socks were a dollar too. The little um, skeletons and pumpkins and then these little wiggly eyes. And then they had these little books and she loves these little things. So I grabbed this. This was also in the Target dollar spot and this will go in her little play area. And I think it was three bucks. 
And then from regular Target merch, and I shared this stuff on Instagram, but I'll share it here. I picked up these little pumpkins and these are the Threshold brand and they were $5 a piece. And when I do my tablescape, I thought these would be cute to add a little bit of texture along with my white pumpkins that I'm gonna be doing. So I picked up these, $5 a piece. And then the Magnolia line at Target, they came out Magnolia Home with some dish soap. And I don't know about you guys, but dish soap has been hard to come by. So I grabbed the Juniper scent. And I like the bottle. These aren't glass, these are plastic, which is perfect, but they're that amber color. And then I picked up the countertop spray to match, and I thought that was really cute. And the color is, I like the coloring. It kind of goes with what I'm doing in the kitchen. And then I also picked up, these have been out in my Target the whole time, <laughs> that since March. Um, but I, they finally had them in, so I picked up three cents. I love to burn like wax melts. So I got the Cozy Cashmere, which is one of my favorite scents. Um, it smells like, like a fresh cleaned sweater, like kind of like a, I don't know. It just smells glorious. So fresh cas cashmere. These were only $1.99. Oh, the soaps were $7.99. And then I'm not a big pumpkin spice girl, but I'm not the only one that lives in the house. And I thought that um, my son and my husband, everybody would like that scent in Bro Brooklyn, like wafting through the house. So I picked up one and I'm not mad at it, but it's not my favorite, but a pumpkin spice. And then this one is glorious, vanilla bean and amber. It just smells like heaven. And I picked up one of those. And then also, and I'll just show you guys, I just ordered our Halloween pajamas off from Carter's. They, to me, have the best deal for the family. But I also picked up these ones from Target and they were only $12.99 and they're for Brookie. And they have these little boob hands. It's a three piece. She's obsessed with a tutu. And then they have this. And then of course the tutu. She still wears hers almost every day from last year. And then, so those little headbands are fun dress up ones, but she is like a headband queen. She's obsessed with headbands. So I picked up these little cat ones. They are the Cat and Jack brand. They were only $5.99. And I thought they would be really cute to wear with during September, October, just with any of her, her little outfits. I thought they would be really cute. She has like a couple of kitty dresses with kitties on them and stuff like that. And I thought it would be really adorable. And then I picked up this like kitty unicorn one, I guess. And this was also $5.99. And I just thought they would be really cute. And she's kind of obsessed with headbands right now. And then I also grabbed, they were, on, they were on sale for $4. See what I mean? Kitty, kitty. These little um, pants. These remind me of like, I don't know, I think of like an animal print or something. But these and some maroon ones. But yeah, that was mostly decor haul. And then I threw a little extra stuff in there. But I want to thank you guys so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed shopping with me for some fall items and seeing what they had in the stores. I didn't do an in-depth one. I didn't do like go over every little detail thing, but I showed you guys some of my favorite pieces. Um, I will link down below. I have a Walmart shop with me, a Hobby Lobby shop with me. Um, and a Target one, the Hearth and Hand shop with me. So I will link those down in the description box below if you are obsessed with all things fall like I am. But thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you guys in my next video, which will probably be fall related. Bye guys.